Welcome to the world of Tamriel. Today we are going to, to be um, observing as kingdoms rise and fall and rise and fall again and whatever. But here we have the map of Tamriel. Of course, I tried my best to um, seed the world with, uh, with its population, of course, but I couldn't actually like, contain the... Um, I don't actually know how to like you know, make the political and the um, cultural border the same as, uh, you know, within the actual, like, lore of the, of the game that we are referencing here. But, um, yeah, I'm still pretty new to this. But I've tried my best. I've tried my best to, like, keep the territory where and the culture where they are. Of course, cities are all over the place, but uh, you know, you could we could observe the um, culture map here, and we see that um, you know it's kind of like same place. We have red guards, we have Breton, we have the orcs over here, we have Nords in Skyrim, we have the Imperial, you know, Argonians, Khajiit, whatever, and um, yeah, so. I've already let the, the game run a bit so that kingdom could expand a little bit, but um, uh, they kind of expand into places where it's not very accurate to the lore. So maybe treat this as like a alternate reality, alternate reality somehow. Okay. So anyway, let's start by putting diplomacy random event on, rebellion on, stealing border on, and all of these are okay. All right. And let's start. So I'm gonna go ahead and increase the time. I mean the speed of our world here by um, activating this sonic speed. And what do we have here already? Well, first of all, what do we have here? Who are you? You're from Red Guard. You're on the um, Elim here. Okay. So Emilut over here, trying to attack the Khajiit over in South High Rock in a war with Hammerfell. Not sure what Emilut is, but they stem from the Hammerfell people that I see over there. Somehow Cyrodiil has. Um, yet to even leave the uh, center island. Very interesting. That whole place over here is supposedly to be um, the Imperial, but I guess the Imperial in this timeline got uh, got kind of stunted by their by the, the neighbors countries. Uh, Skyrim at war against the orcs. Okay. Let's um. Speed up. All right, sonic speed is on, and we see what happens here. Already, we can see a lot of territorial change of going on. Hammerfell seeking to control this part of the map. The orcs having a big war against High Rock and Skyrim. Skyrim belong to the north and well I don't know what this part the, the northern coastline is like uh, habited, inhabited by the orcs for now of course until we can solve the orc problem same with this little village over here oh Hammerfell what are you what are you doing you're getting like curb stomped by the emulute Vale of Wood expanded upwards to the north into the uh, Emilit. It's not a that's not a lore correct country, but like who cares? The um, Argolian over here doing pretty decent, although the origi original Argolian country, the Black Marsh over here has already been um, wiped off the map. Morrowind 
it's doing fine. But uh, the uh, air attic keepers in ancient Amion Aeona kind of like stunted the growth of, of them of the Morrowind. This island finally getting conquered by none other than who is this? Uh, it's Somerset. Wait, what? Somerset? It's out from down here. How the frick does it even get up there? That's like Somerset. Where, where the fuck is Somerset? Oh my god. Like, they, they somehow sailed from across the map to go up here. Ugh. Who the fuck named their kingdom? Ugh. What is this? There's, there's the Breton creature. What the fuck? Alright, this, uh, this makes no freaking sense. Okay. So <laughs> Khajiit, Khajiit have uh, seized a large territory over here. Okay, okay. It, interesting. The coastal Argonian is uh, pushing against the center Argonian, while uh, you know original Argonian is like push elsewhere. Dunmer Nurkro is like much stronger for some reason. Cyrodiil is like kind of. Kind of in a in a bad place, huh? At least in this game, easy horde, very easy, right? Well, man, kingdoms are like already like uh, wiping each other out. And uh, we are still not even close to the 1,000 year mark. Only 200 years have, have, have passed. And the high rock are getting driven out of their own place there. North Point Orcs have uh, seized the other territory of the, of the Orsinian. Let me look at the um, village slayer. Yeah, look at this. They only have Daggerfall now, and Daggerfall might even fell. Now the Red Guards having a civil war against themselves in this in this part of the continent. Meanwhile, who even is this? Where are you from? Argonians? What the heck are Argonians doing over there? Man, the Khajiit are building like a, like a huge, huge empire. Somehow Cyrodiil is still um, doing pretty good. What? What? Cyrodiil is now Skyrim territory? What the? I mean, Skyrim is like, Skyrim is like, it's like driven out. Oh my God, Skyrim! <laughs> what is happening here? Excuse me, Skyrim is now Cyrodiil, <laughs> Imperial city, <laughs> belong to the to the North, I guess. Where are the original Norths? These aren't Norths. These are orcs. I guess the Nords are like God. Nords are God. That's quick. I didn't expect the Nord to be done in like, uh, what, 245 years? They seem to have a good start. Now they, now the Nords are gone, the only like inheritance of their, of their culture are actually the freaking Imperial who are protect, a little bit protected in their little island in Cyrodiil. I just can't believe fucking Skyrim is now in the center of the map. Uh, Skyrim might also fall too, so this is the end for them. Well, Skyrim is the is the you know gone, reduced to atoms. And Cyrodiil's just fall. Goodbye.
It's killed by freaking Khajiit. Who are these people? They are bread thorns. The culture layers. Redgar seems to be doing the best here. Khajiit is like absolutely dominating the south. Argonian coastal. Argonian center is like nowhere to be seen. Oh, there they are. The kingdom wise. Um, only several of the original kingdoms are still doing strong, which is we have elsewhere over here. Somehow have climbed up to this fucking part. What is this? What is this territory? I think. Oh, this Hammerfell. Hammerfell somehow secure like a like a part ear, like a like a settlement. Who work? Very weird. North Point Orc, not even like my original like creation. The start like dominating the northern part of. Uh... Hang on, let me look at the actual map. It's High Rock. Eh, Somerset and like, you know, Somerset still doing pretty fine, although they are in the process of being annexed by their neighboring Tohill kingdom. Tohill? And Hammerfell's like actually doing good though. So Red Guards are like dominating that part of the, of the mainland. Pretty developed cities. Although they are surrounded by, by, um, by orcs and by the Khajiit. Morwin kind of so kind of like in the process of being genocide. Goodbye, Morwin. Man, wow. Okay, Somerset, <laughs> Somerset somehow uh, getting removed from their homeland and now have to settle in. Freaking like around the the volcano over here. Interesting. Vardin fell. Freaking this is Balmora, isn't it? <laughs> this makes no freaking sense. This is when you have like this is when you play HOI with uh, with history accuracy off. It just it just complete garbage nonsense, and I love it. Uh, there are way too much shit to like actually observe here, so let's see. We have this map actually have a lot of like waterways, so you know navy is actually kind of kind of like important. Built a lot of ports and uh, countries that are in the peripheral of the map, corner of the map rather, is it's kind of safe. Like Toe Hill over here. Um, I don't know. Why this island hasn't even been like considered as a colonized place? But okay, maybe it's too small. Well, this island up north over here is you know kind of small too. But uh, Kokari. But you know they are still settled. The tall Igdis. They are Argonians, and somehow they have a piece of land. Well, they used to have a piece of land over here. Uh, who are these? Are these? Well, Somerset is now in Cyrodiil. Okay, so I guess the elves are like doing. The elves are doing a lot better than others. Uh, maybe Khajiit, you know. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Original Khajiit kingdom is now in the freaking Black Marsh. Elsewhere, they have seized. They've been, they've been driven out by the Gono fighter. Also, Kashit, by the way. Clan of Duzuk. This is Argonians. I guess they uh, switch territories with each other. This orc, right? Orsinium orcs. Acts of Keo Keguak. What is this? These are just orcs. Urg of death. We like food. 
Azos. Death is up, dog. What's up, dog? <laughs> okay. Well, um, very interesting kingdom name. What? What is? How is Cyrodiil doing? It's not even named Cyrodiil anymore. What is this? What is this town? Yo, Yosahiari. Well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. War happening up north in the corner map? That's not possible. What is this? Whoa, what is this? They're gonna keepers. Huh, this... This island is small as shit, and yet... You know, they keep getting, like, uh, divided between... Two kingdoms, for some reason. Meanwhile, Hammerfell over here... Is, like, actually stable. Let me look at the Red Guard culture and see what they have. Zone Control 2, okay. Culture Spread 3. Governance 1. So if they are lucky, they might even get Governance 3 and Zone Control 3. And th at that point, they are pretty much impossible to, like, stop. Axe of Patpot. Wait, what are these? Toad X Dicks. Eat dick, eat dick. All right, what? No, sorry. Um, children clothes. I mean, um, you know, cover your ears. I guess. Well, uh, sure. Why not? Somerset is now is now in the freaking. Uh, it's here. It's in these. It is in the uh, you know island of uh, Vardafell. Varden, Vardenfell? Vardenfell? I don't actually play Elder Scrolls. Again, most of this kind of game I don't actually play. I just like the, um, the lore. And I never actually remember... Like, what they are actually. You know, what... What the lore actually is. Why does this thing does not show up on the map? We use our in that... The Argonians here. Wait, who are these? Well, they, they're gone now. Man, this this southern part of the kingdom, of the of the continent rather, is like really unstable. Tohill is back again on their um, biggest territorial gain. Even have like a piece of land up in the north, east. Oh, this is a freaking Morwin. This <laughs> a Morwin uh, BGM. Time for some uh, just derpy ass NPC speech. The act of Kyoga, who are or who who comes from Oceanian or culture, actually like freaking dominating the uh, Skyrim part of the of the continent, and you know encroaching southwards. I wonder what kind of culture advantages do have. Governance 2, Zone Control 1. So not that good, but um, you know, they kind of like, they kind of like doing pretty well. East Altmer, a way of life, fortification, Zone Control 2, Governance 1. Also East Altmer, this original Altmer. Zone Control 2, okay. North Red Guard, Way of Life, Offensive Strategy. Argonian. Defensive Strategy, okay. Coastal Argonian, have Ancestor Knowledge. Culture Spread, Culture Spread 1. I mean, Khajiit having Zone Control 2 without actually Zone Control 1. So they kind of skip a level here. Very interesting strategy. I I wonder why Otmer is like in Cyrodiil. Huh. Yeah, it's because of the Somerset. Freaking Enclave. Man, the um the the human part of the uh culture is actually like not doing pretty good actually not doing any any good here. Only Hammerfell slept, honestly. Only Hammerfell is like 
the human kingdom is left. I mean, it's the only kingdom that is human left on this map. Meanwhile, it's just like uh, Khajiit. Uh, no, Khajiit here with, um, you know, Hargonian with a bunch of orcs and the elves. Kind of surprising. Ancient Ikona. Wait, what? Why is this Hammerfell? What the fuck? Why is this place Hammerfell now? What the? Or, or has it already been Hammerfell before? Or I, and I just like not notice? God, this freaking map. Except for Hammerfell, everything else just makes no freaking sense. How many of the original like country, I mean city I, that I put in here? Lilandro is here. Um, Sentinel is here. North Point is here. Fiana, Farun. Cyrodiil's gone, though. No. This one is just called Khan. Hellstrom, Torn. Still there. Archon, Black Rose. Blackwood. Corinth. Bottle. Very, uh... Well, at least the city is still there, but like, the culture is completely fucked up. And the kingdom is like... Okay, so we have southward, we have clan of Oz Ozort. Axe of Patpot. What is this? Who are these? Oh, they are elsewhere. It's a freaking... It's a freaking Khajiit. But if you look at the culture, it's actually like Argonian. So Khajiit and Argonian have like form an alliance with each other. Hammerfell still kind of doing a lot better than I expected. Although because they are the only human kingdom left, um, they are not going to have a lot of advantage in in terms of like battling because instead of like instead of like um, you know just reclaim territories like the other country. They had to like actively battle and destroy the um, the other country to actually gain the land. So like that's a lot of work. I I bet that Hammerfell would eventually be like they would be like uh, you know driven out into the um, into the northern island over here. Yep, as I said, that has already happened. Hammerfell's like up, up on top of the map with. Only the island left. Well, this territory is still here, but um, I wager that uh, it's not gonna stand there for much longer. Oh, yep, there it is. Hammerfell's like reduced to like the corner of the map, which you know kind of open up more space for the orcs to like advance in. Or are, are these even the orcs? Still are orcs. These are orc. These are Khajiit. All right. Man, Khajiit orcs and like and like the elves are like actually, uh, actually like <laughs> kind of dominating here. This is a fucked up world. The orcs are not even supposed to be like a like a strong. Like a strong race in like um, I mean they're not they're not dominating the whole map like in 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 here it's it, they are just like a bunch of like diaspora all, all over the place and you know concentrated over here in the um, high rock mountains and yet somehow they just kind of like graze through the entire like entirety of the human kingdoms. Khajiit also kind of like, kind of like, uh, you know, becoming stronger than, a lot stronger than I expected. Probably because I use Khajiit as, um, I use like orcs race in this, in this um, game as a stand-in for the Khajiit and the Argonians. So I guess they are, there are a lot more of them than actually um, supposed to be. And they can actually like, reclaim lands from each other, so like that's some that's something, yeah. 
very interesting. Very interesting. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and... Well, no. We're gonna go and, and play until it reaches um, 1,000 years mark. For now, it's just like we're only halfway there. Man, Skyrim territory completely filled with orcs. Meanwhile, Hammerfell's like, eh, you know, we tried. We are awesome in the light. Capital is now Ubork Island. What do they have? Ah, Adamantite. They don't actually have any weapons or so like that. Kind of sucks. At least they kept the culture, right? Yeah, the Red Guards culture. So, you know, with culture like this, they can still, uh, like, make weapons and, that, and stuff. Oh my god, there are so many stuffs here. Okay. Man, it kind of sucks that this island is, like, too small. But, uh, yeah, who cares, right? It's freaking, it's freaking Khajiit over here. Man, what the fuck? What the heck is this? All right, what do you what do you have for me, um, Somerset Cyrodiil? Wind shooter, created by Atetanor, Atetanor from Somerset, Lura. From Somerset, Iron Bow, Wretched Bow. As soon as you have iron stuff, very, very, uh, kind of still good, but, um, we're still in the Iron Age, it seems. Stone Axe. These guys have already gone to Silver. Misfortune Reaver, and that's a good name. What about you, Tohill? What do you have? Silver stuff, okay. Steel, nice. How about the orcs? Iron axe, wooden stick. Okay, so let's count. Um, elf kingdom, elf kingdom, elf kingdom. Probably Khajiit, probably Argonians, probably Khajiit, orcs, orcs. Orcs, orc, 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 human. Didn't have any, um, I didn't have any uh, place to put a dwarf in. I don't even know what race would constitute a dwarf in, in Skyrim. You know, what should be? Oh, hey, they built a barracks. In a, in a Cyrodiil here. Very nice. I like this place. It's kind of chill. It's like an island that is uh, kind of protected from all sides. So I guess if Somerset, if somehow they fell, they still have like, uh, you know, that place, Cyrodiil. But I guess this place is still pretty good because, first of all, this is an island, so like, you know, if, if you want to invade a country in... Uh, in Warbox, you need to have like a landing boat, a landing ship rather, and uh, landing ship probably have like a set limit for how much, how much troops can be carried. So having a having an island territory is actually like pretty good for defense. That's why Tohill over here have yet to be the, like invaded from outside. Somerset can actually like protect themselves by being a bunch of islands and uh, Hammerfell can... well Hammerfell only have six people left so I could, don't know what actually happened here wow doesn't seem to be anybody left except for like you know the six people who are all you know across the world or something oh I see they are being stuck here on this tiny ass island waiting to die the poor, poor human. Okay, so here's the thing, okay? 
It said that Hammerfell still have five people left, but that's because um, these people are like stuck in other parts of the map, and now they don't have any boats left. There are no no more Hammerfell boats left for them to like actually go back to their homeland and like rebuild. So they are kind of fucked. Well, goodbye Hammerfell. You are never missed. Man, if that happens, Somerset would be the only kingdom left. Yeah, because even the um even the elsewhere as far from the um Khajiit are like gone now. So I guess Somerset is like the only kingdom left that's standing. Well, uh, no, wrong. North Orc points. They're not one of, they are not a kingdom. They used to, there's just probably some fucking tribes like over here, but like, uh, you know, they're still doing fine, so... Okay, five people left in Hammerfell. I mean, four Hammerfell people. Four Z Hammerfell people, rather. My, my English is not good. Can't pass. Damn, this, this actually, like... This kingdom is, like, huge, and they have, like... They are pretty loyal. What is this culture? Khajiit culture. Uh, trading boat, transport boat, dark mine, statue, temple, culture conversion, culture spread, hammer, sword, zone control, knowledge skin three. So pretty strong. They have a part over here too. So like the orc are Orsinian Orsinian orcs. Rot orc points are just norm orcs. Blood of orc dudes. Or seen in orcs, okay. Does us warrior. Khajiit. Who is Skyrim belonging to right now? Skyrim belong to the orcs. I'm just like waiting for Hammerfell to fall. And yet, they are still surviving, somehow. Like, if they have like a building that, are, that is complete, they might be able to like... Um, bounce back their culture, I mean bounce back their population, but... With the, with the freaking population reducing to these... Like... Um, dying people... Who are stuck... Outside of Hammerfell, I, I don't think there's much chance for them to like... Go back. Maybe unless you know. Maybe if like a, an elf, an elf culture and a, an orc culture kind of go into war with each other, then they might have some some space. But uh, not much of a chance. I don't think that's gonna happen. So we wait. We await for the last ha of the Hammerfell people, uh, last of the Red Guards to like die off. Man, this this can pass kingdom or whatever is like actually kind of good at what they are doing. You know, they have already like seized the um, southern part of the continent, and now they're seeking to like go north and spread to the um, the east. They are the strongest kingdom right now and very stable too. Well, yes. Now we now we we'll wait for whoever can get this part, can get this this island. Will it be the Khajiit? Will it be the Orcs? Will it be um? Well, Somerset, what happened? Why did you like suddenly die? Only seven people left. Oh, even Cyrodiil is gone. Hot damn. Somerset, you kind of like disappoint me a little bit here. You were doing so well. How did you get into this situation? Where are the rest of the people? I don't actually see any of the um, the elves from Somerset left. 
even though there's still like a lot of East Elmer, I don't actually know where they are. Man, if Somerset fell, Somerset just fell, okay. Well, good luck. There's still, there are still at least 200 and something East Elmer left. I think they are from the uh, ancient Ikona kingdom. And they try to settle this island, okay. So, you know, at least, at least they are not extinct, but um, sad for Somerset. They, uh, they they try their best. They start off from here, they go up here, and now they gone. Who is controlling Cyril? It's the Orsinium Orcs, of course. Of course it has to be the Orcs. They're not even supposed to be here. And now they're dominating the entire landscape. Even Tohill is like not safe from, from an invasion. Hot damn. What year is this? 600. So not even 1000. We're still going pretty slow. Sonic speed is still on. Man, kind of sucks that uh, <laughs> almost none of the kingdom left. I mean, none of the original kingdom are left in this, in this map. Only the North Point Arc works are, are from one of the places that I um, original kind of like put in, even though they are like kind of an afterthought. Tohi over here, you know, still grabbing onto Somerset Island. What about culture? Because kingdom can change, but culture is like kind of stay along. So Altmer and East Altmer is still here. Argonian center is somehow over here now. Original Argonian are, you know, kind of in the same place somewhat. Khajiit South, Khajiit Normal Orcs, or Senium Orcs are probably the biggest culture. The Nerd Crow is still here. This is, this is East Alper, right? Yeah. What is that war? Ancient Eokona, what are you doing? You're fighting against Blood of Octus. Let's look at the culture. Um, so the orcs have... Uh, the, the, the normal... Like non-civilized or have now civilized and had become civilized and now sees a big part of the um, territory in the coastal region. So I guess they have they're kind of like fishing people or for now, right? Navy fishing kind of stuff. Not really. Okay. What about our senior works? Let's start building church now, huh? Uh. Okay. Well, I kind of want to see what kind of like church building looks like for these guys. Maybe it's this thing. I don't know. Khajiit. Khajiit has damn good house. What if you have coins? I guess this is a church, yeah? What the fuck is this? Is this a burger? Burger statue? Kinda wanna observe the elves. Man, this place like 
ruined. What happened? Only ancient air corner. Air corner is like uh, standing strong. This part of, of the territory also seized by orcs. Soon enough, we will see orcs all over the place. Orc, Khajiit, and um, and uh, Argonians. Just freaking everywhere. Only two elves kingdom left. Kind of untouched. And they are in the corner in the corner of the map. So I guess they are not, you know they're not in contest with others. Except for maybe maybe this part of the peninsula. I kinda of jut out here. Strong Ranua. I think the elves are still doing fine. Man. Okay. Wow, how the... How the hell is that only like... 690 something? We still have 300 years left. And the orcs have already like... Sort of um... Driving other species to extinction. I guess only orcs and Argonians and 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 uh, Khajiit. Well, basically it's the same thing in this um, in this uh, game because I only I only have orcs to like represent the whole part of the beast people. Kind of unfortunate that, but you know that's how the game works. Man, I, I kind of want to see Skyrim a little bit more, but um, I guess it is, it is how it is, you know. Next time, m next time I will be like, you know, uh, I will try to like remove the orcs away, I guess. Nah, but still, I don't know. I mean, I still have some other maps that are, that are Skyrim-esque, yeah. We have um, the Elder Scroll here. We have, um, yeah, we have the Elder Scroll map too. So like, that is still there as an option. So maybe next time we'll see some kind of different thing happens. But for now, it's it's the orcs. They are ruthless. They expand everywhere, and now they have dominated the entire landscape. I say orcs, but you know. You have to understand that they are not just like orcs, but also um, mostly Khajiit in the south, orc in the north, and Argolian in the uh, kind of southeast. Some of Argolian center is like here. Man, North Point orc is like kind of kind of good. Blood of Octus. Ancient Eo Ikona has been has been pushed out, and they only have this little island left. Is that that might even fall? The orcs have. Uh, I say orc, but I don't actually know if they are actually orcs or are they like Kashit or are they like you know Argonians? Yeah. Okay. So um. Kind of sucks for the elves. It seems as if orc want to colonize this piece of land. Yep. Goodbye, ancient Ikona. You are gone. So, so Tohil, Tohil is the only elven kingdom left. On and they are kind of be, being ignored in. Uh, in a Somerset Island. Okay, so who 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 does this? Coastal Argonians. Okay, well it makes sense. They are coastal Argonians after all. They probably sell very good, so they can you know kind of go ahead and like conquer the island. Since this map have a lot of like ocean and a lot of like waterways. You can see why, you know, the um, the coastal 
sort of culture are like doing really really good against the uh, against those those arises from the mainland but um kind of slanted towards the orcs because they have they are more aggressive they're more aggressive and they kind of drive out other, other species orcs Khajiit and uh, Argonians rather because you know all of them are, are like represented by orc in this game the only uh, outlier here is is Tohill which is an elf kingdom in Somerset Island and it's in a in a, it's in a region where there are like not much traffic so they are kind of like ignored which means they also kind of like you know are safe from uh, expansionist kingdom I mean North Point or is probably like the winner of this uh, of this uh, you know battle royale Can't pass North Point Orcs are like a superpower right here. Man, how many of the original like city are left? North Point, Little and Drill, Black Rose, Nelstrom, Torn, Archon, Blackwood, Dune, Current. Tor Torval, Topal, uh, and that's probably it. Freaking, there's a Seiko Zoro over here. Okay, here we go in one piece. The one piece. Okay. Man, come on. You have like a like a nice little island here. Maybe they will de develop it a little bit. I guess they just don't have enough wood. What the North Point or kind of like sp getting split here? Copas Brothers. Meanwhile, Kenpas just like keep expanding. The freaking Khajiit are like really good at this game, huh? Look at this. They have like. Surrounded this uh, this part of Black Marsh. And I said that the freaking Azos is like rising up again. Azos used to be here and red, now they are like green. Copas Brother have driven North Point Orc to like. Oh no, North Point Orcs, what happened? You're about to die. Well, say goodbye to the North Point Orcs. As we approach um, year 800. Ah, Copas Brothers have completely uh, replaced the North Point Orcs. One is the older kingdom. I guess the older kingdom now is like Tohill. It's one of the kingdoms that are, you know, there when I first started, but not one of the kingdoms that I actually like, you know, renamed. Man, this place looks actually like pretty nice. Okay. Helmet or anchor. Can pass also kind of like on their. It's like you know they're they're declining a little bit. So yeah, anyone who can seize an island, usually will become the winner. Or at least the survivor of like you know, oldest culture. What is what is Cyrodiil called right now? 
Urk ass. God, I fucking hate the orc name in this uh, in this game. It's just like it's just like complete. Um, it just grunts. Or see him orc orc. Kajit, Gonian center. Gonian coastal. Kajit south. Altmer is still here. Completely uh, ignored. Same with East Altmer. Man, you guys are lucky, huh? Kind of like getting ignored by all of the death and destruction of, like happening in the, in the rest of the continent. What do you have in uh, in store? Mithril. Damn, that's some good shit. I guess that's why they can defend the island pretty well. Aside from just, you know, being ignored. What do you have right now? Steel axe? Come on. Just garbage. Okay, let's see what North Point... Wow, North Point doesn't even have, like, good weapon. It doesn't have anything. What is the capital of this? It's Tenet. Other kingdoms are really poor, but they have strength in number. Rusty Pluto. How do you rust silver? What a crazy ass looking compass brother reduced only like uh, the capital being cut off their other territories are now like you know getting getting claimed by Ken Pass. Ken Pass is like kind of like good at this huh they're really they are doing really well I mean the Khajiit are like no joke Whoa, war in, war in Somerset. What? Ah, uh, whoa, whoa! This, this, this island here has been uh, kind of demolished a little bit. At least they still are like successfully defending their, their place. Who is at war? It's Ken Pass. Of course, it has to be Ken Pass. The fucking Kaji. They're sick to, to to declare war with anyone. What is this? Ah, yes. They are now seeking to destroy the last elf settlement. And we haven't even reached one 1,000 year mark. Please, destroy the orcs. I don't want to see last the last of the elves, like, gone. But that might actually become the truth here. Man, they can destroy the uh, your building with like lightnings, lightning weapon. Oh damn! At least they all still have like you know some people left to bounce back, but I don't think they can they gotta do very well because look at this they already like you know kind of destroyed halfway on there. I mean they have one foot in the in the coffin already. City are like sacked. No, there's not much people left, and uh, the orcs just keep coming, or like the Khajiit rather. Oh man, what on earth is orc ban? Is here? Damn, not fast, freaking Algonian. Okay, you still have to claim on the on the small island, so still some chance. There's still a chance. Please survive until one thousand, so I can declare you. The victor. Still surviving. Still good. Still at war against the... Uh, whatever this is. Old Axis. How are there three freaking kingdoms competing for this tiny island?
Pariu. Copas Brothers, Blood of Octus and Bat Zetezot. Passes all the way over here. Copas Brothers kind of makes sense. And Blood of Octus is like all the way up here. So how the fuck are they so good at like colonizing land halfway across the map? At least Toe Hill is like, you know, surviving. I don't know how long they can do this. They only have a patch of like wheat. They have like a little bit of water and like ore. And they have no trees. No wood. They can't live like this. Oh man. The Copas Brothers. In the can pass, still finding each other. Teeth. Uh, I don't know what the idiom is. Teeth something, I don't know. Okban rising up to be one of the more dominant culture. I mean, dominant kingdom. What is your culture? Coastal Argonian? What is this place? Back city. So, why is this a thing? Like this, this capital is the capital is here, right? And then some, and then they kind of like uh, you know expand over here, and 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 they have an enclave over here, and then they freaking have a, a freaking island, a, a piece of the island for no reason. Oh no, Toll Hill, no, no, they are they are getting invaded. Oh, it sucks. It sucks to see this. The rest of the elves are dead. I don't think they have. Um, I don't think they have anything left. One more, one more raid, and, and they are gone. Five. Four. And gone. Well, that is uh, that is sad sight sight to see. None of the original kingdom that I put here even survive one thousand years of advancement, one thousand years of war, one thousand years of death, one thousand years of expansion, of discovery, adventure, and now they just fucking. Orcs and like Khajiit, Agodians everywhere. No longer any more elves. No more, no more, no more of the of the normal men. So uh, yeah, this resembles nothing of the original Skyrim. Kind of sad, kind of sad to see, but um, yeah, that's that's the nature of this game. It's chaotic. Like, even Ken Pass doesn't even survive. We have like 100 years left. Ken Pass is like. This, last, it's, this is their last leg. They have been reduced to like. A bit of, a bit of land that is contested here. And this place. Copas Brothers. Uh. The coastal region are still fine, but uh, but they are you know getting driven out of uh, of the mainland. Man, okay. Well, none of this resemble what I put in here earlier, but um, culture layers to should still be fine. Orcidium orcs are like the biggest culture. Normal orc. Relegated to the um, to the coastal regions and um, you know waterways and stuff. Argonian center is like they still have a little colony here in this um, peninsula. The Khajiit are probably one of the more successful one 
having like a large territory. Same with Kajit South. Well, like, you know, okay. even this place like Kajit, that is interesting. Coastal Gohonian, living by their name, kind of expand coastally. In the coastal region, sorry. And uh, our Gohonians kind of like still swampy ass people, man. Swampy ass lizards. Alright. Switch back to kingdom. Uh, some 20 years, 70 years left. Well, we'll see what is what is uh, the oldest kingdom. I'm just gonna let the game run for a bit. Meanwhile, I need to take a break. Not sure what did I miss, but um, it looks like Copass Browser is now only can only control this part here, the peninsula. Kind of sucks that none of the country can like you know grab take grab a, a large piece of land. You know, but that's the nature of like having rebellion on. You know, it's more interesting this way. If I only like. You know, like if I like put a rebellion down, it's not gonna be as exciting. Bigger, bigger country will just eat smaller countries, and like that's not fun. Nine hundred seventy-four. Only a few years left, boss. Kings are like dying in droves. War still happening. Kind of want to see how the culture is spreading, though. Seems that uh, Southern Khajiit is like the more dominant culture here in the island of uh, Somerset. Although other culture have uh, started showed up too. Khajiit holding on a large piece of a culture, influencing a lot of the um, kingdom. So Orsinium Orcs still kind of like, they are, they, they are kind of like contained in this part of the map. Like Skyrim and all that, 
surrounds. The orcs are, the normal orcs are like, um, I don't know, they are kind of all over the place. Surrounding the Orsinium orc though. Coastal Argonian, normal Argonian, center Argonian, south Khajiit. Nine ninety one, nine ninety two, nine ninety three, nine ninety four, nine ninety five, nine ninety six. Come on, only four years left. Let's see, nine ninety seven, nine hundred and ninety. Eight. Two years left till the end of the millennium. And eleven thousand. All right. So what do we have? What are the oldest culture? What is the biggest kingdom? We have Bat Zenet. Bo is away. The Khajiit culture. Capital is Tokais. And 86 years old. Meanwhile, he's a neighbor of uh, Azok. 121 years old. Skajit culture. Not only 86. To Ezurk. Finger or anger. King is Reno. Alright. Um, or culture. 32 years old Kopas brothers having only like these two pieces of land 231st years old though or culture capital is Pares top no king culture is orc 34 years old probably on their way out a deuce or culture uh 160 years old okay so i guess um uh, much older than this one but not as old as Kopas brothers blood of orc deuce 577 years old hot damn and they only control a little bit of land here k top axis very early, very young kingdom, only six years old. Arsenium orcs. These guys are like normal orcs. Oh, hang on, what? Blood of Oak. Orc culture. Cock yak. <laughs> Alright, that's a not safe for work name. Cock gag. Okay, no, don't, don't say that twice, please. Come on, five years old, kingdom. Uh, I hope you freaking like go away. Huh? Why? Why does this not like show up in the name? Oh, there, because it's up here. Very scattered kingdom. How about Azok? One hundred twenty-one years old. Okay, but Zetezot. 389 years of Argolian coastal culture. Blood of Oskik. Orsinium orcs. Capital is Dekas. Five years old. We are tears in the darkness. Right. Clan of Norris. 144 years old. Tail in the light. Zetor. Ok Uk. 40 years old, Argolian culture. Dus Ik. Khajiit culture. 32 years old. So I think the oldest culture has to be this guy, right? Kopas Brothers. Yeah. I No, wait. I thought it was like. Yeah, because this guy, like 577 years old. So Blood of Okdus is the oldest culture currently 
So I guess we hand them the win. I mean, they did pretty well. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> so honestly, though, it's just like, what kind of, what kind of, like, um, culture is that? Not kingdom. I was supposed to say that, you know, Bullets of Octus is like the oldest kingdom. I, I supposedly, I, you know, but uh, I mistakenly speak uh, culture, but the oldest culture is probably, I mean, the biggest culture, rather, because all the culture are like, you know, arise in the same era, same age. Biggest culture is Khajiit, with 2,140 people. Or Senium Orc, second place, 2,100. 2,084 people. Third place goes to the Orc, 1,075 people. Argonian Coastal, 1,048 people. And last place is Khajiit South. Wait, no. Uh, Orsinium Orc, Khajiit Argonian with 1,573 is the third place. And then fourth is like Orc. 50 Argonian Coastal and like last place Khajiit South. No, 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 not last place. Last place is Argonian Center over here. I almost forgot about this village. Always forgot about them. Well, that's the end. That is, uh, that's it. It sucks that none of the um, human kingdom survived, none of the elf kingdom survived. And um, yeah, so stay tuned because we still have a lot a lot, a lot of the um, of the other maps that I have downloaded, and even more to come because you know, Speed Workshop is like save a lot of stuff. Maybe Mid Earth will be like next. Maybe like um, whatever this Elder Scroll thing is. Still Elder Scroll map, but um. Kind of different and having like a like a northern part too so how about this what is this it's mid we have a normal normal fantasy map here maybe i will try to like um think of something cr more creative some some map from from games that are you wouldn't expect to see you know so i guess stay tuned and if they are not on the workshop, I might be able to like, you know, make their own, make my own like map. Alright, see ya.